Okay, we have 482 coming out there for the hit and run. You might wait for it. 482. I had some major traumatic instances in my life. You tend to um, have visions come back. I call it my, my slide projector. My projector has hundreds of images. And you'll just be sitting there at night maybe and, and these images will start sliding through your brain of traumatic incidences. That's on the highway where young kids have been killed. But when somebody killed somebody or somebody committed suicide, when I pick up that kid that just got killed on the highway, dies in my hands, who has to go in that hospital and tell me? Your six-year-old kid just got killed. They make it die. Who? Me. Besides picking the kid up off the street dead, now I gotta go and tell the parents. And it's very hard to us to admit to ourselves we have a problem because we were the ones protecting and serving. We didn't have the problems. You had the problem. I came to save you. A lot of us will throw off to drugs and alcohol. And I have done that. And see, that's, that, that was part of crumbling down. I would disappear. And I'm just driving for hours because I have these visions and memories in my mind I can't get rid of. I started to feel like, you know, there's something not right here. He's, he's not in his right mind. I didn't even know that police officers dealt with post-traumatic stress. I didn't know this. And who am I attacking? The people that love me. I try to get help, and I try to get help. The four psychiatrists all failed. Two therapists failed. Counselor failed. And if it wasn't for a thing called TM, I would not be sitting in this chair. Through the TM, it's all gone away. Don't get me wrong, I still get, you know, memories and this, but it's controllable now. I'm not seeing that kid I picked up off the road dead. I'm able to control it without drugs, without alcohol. I saw light coming through this man's eyes that I had not seen, and I can't tell you how long. It was miraculous. I have no idea where I would be in life right now yeah. if it wasn't for it, none. I don't know if I'd be a drug addict in the gutter somewhere, an alcoholic laying on the side or dead. That I asked myself, to be totally honest. Life changer? You kidding me? You asking me that question? I might not be here without it. You ask me, is that a life changer, you know, right? Yeah. Right? Hell yeah! <laughs>